curling team is preparing to defend its world title. Emily Deem is live in Oshkosh with more. Hi, Em. Good morning, Rachel and Pete. Hi, everybody. We are at Julie's Touch of Silver Dance Studio this morning in Oshkosh. Take a look behind me. We are hanging with the Touch of Silver Twirling Corps this morning. The girls that you see here will be representatives for Team USA. There are about 30 girls here from the Oshkosh and surrounding area. They're going to be heading to Switzerland, you guys, to defend their world title. Julie Secker Anderson is here with me to tell me a little bit more. She is owner out here of the studio and coach. Julie, good morning to you. Good morning. Thank All right. Oh, thanks for being here with us. So tell us about the girls and the competitions they've been going to. Okay. Um, normally throughout the year we go to a state competition, normally just within the area of Milwaukee. We go to regionals. Actually, we are conducting the regionals this year in Oshkosh. Um, national competition is at South Bend, Indiana in Notre Dame University. And this year um, we have a few other local competitions. We're going to a competition in Chicago, Illinois, another one in the Milwaukee area. So that's what we normally do for competing throughout the year. And every three years um, we qualify for the world competition and this year it's going to be held in Switzerland and so we were so fortunate to qualify. Yeah and we have some pictures you guys of when they were in Belgium in 09. Tell us about these girls and able to travel all over the world. Okay. Some of these girls have been actually previously to Holland. That was our very first experience overseas. And then Belgium. And then this year will be Switzerland. So yeah, the amount of travel they get to be exposed to is, it's really a great experience for them. And Julie, you have a daughter, a part of the team, Whitney. Tell me what it's like to watch your daughter perform. Um, I love watching Whitney perform. Um, I had another daughter, Lacey, who also twirled, and now she's out of the core and out of solos. So to have Whitney still involved um, just makes it very special, and she really loves to be a part of this group. The girls are really a great group of girls, and she loves that, and she also does solo competition. And, um, I love watching her. She works really hard, and when she does well, it's, you know, really fun. So. Well, they look like just a very talented group of young ladies, and we're going to be with them all morning, so you won't want to go anywhere, you guys. And if you want to learn more, about them you can visit our website box11online.com just click on good day wisconsin and i think they're going to be trying to teach me some moves later with the baton i've never held one i've oh. never done anything with <laughs> one so so we'll see how this morning goes yeah. but they look like they're pros so i got a lot of competition we'll send it back to you